Hi, I'm Carrie Lee. Welcome to this week's tap class. Today we're going to learn a jitterbug step that we're turning into a tap dance. So go get your tap shoes and let's get started. So today we will be learning some variations of a tap jitterbug step. Just some very fun boogie woogie music. It is for beginners, and I will break it down for beginners and go nice and slow. You should know what a flap is as opposed to a shuffle or a ball change. I have a very helpful video called The ABCs of Tap, which I will link for you if you want to go back and watch that. Also, I want to say if my shoes magically change in the middle of the video, it's because I'm tr still trying to break in my new tap shoes that I got for Christmas. These are triple threats. Uh, Miller and Ben, I always want to say Ben and Jerry's, um, but they're very stiff, so uh, I may get some blisters. So let's get started. A jitterbug is generally, it's a based on a ballroom step, will generally be in a six count pattern. I'm going to turn it into an eight count pattern, which just makes it easier for choreography. So I'm going to add a little twist to the jitterbug. The jitterbug without any tap sounds at all is triple step, triple step, rock step. And you would just keep repeating that triple step, triple step, rock step. For purposes of tap dancing, we'll add a little flappy sound in there and we're gonna go flap, ball change, flap, ball change, rock step, and to turn it into an eight count phrase, I'm going to add a twist, twist, which is fun. So you just step right, left. And one more time, a little bit faster. Five, six, seven, eight. Flap, I'll change, flap, I'll change. Rock, step, twist, twist. So we've learned the jitterbug step, which is going to be sort of the basis for our choreography that we're going into. Another step that I'm going to take from Jitterbug and turn it into a tap step is in Jitterbug, there's a lot of kick, ball, change. Kick, right, left. Kick, step, step. Kick, step, step. And also, when I do the ball change, see I'm sinking out into that hip. Kick, ball, change. Kick, ball change. So there's sort of a twisting the whole time. When I'm kicking, I'm really turning out so that the inside of my leg is showing. And when I ball change, then I'm kind of twisting towards my left foot. So twist right and left, right and left, right and left, right, ball change. And I helpfully kept all those kickball changes on your right foot. You're kicking with the right foot. Now, to make it more tappy, instead of just kicking, we're going to do a shuffle. Ball chain, shuffle, ball chain, shuffle, ball chain, shuffle, ball change. And keeping that little hippie, twisty feeling into what is just based, just a regular tap step. Shuffle, ball change, shuffle, ball change. So it's shuffle, step, right, left. If you're just becoming familiar with ball change. Good, so those are the two basic tap steps that you need to know to get started with this little choreography bit that we're going into. To get started, there's sort of a boogie woogie bass line going and you are going to be, have your weight on your left foot and tap across with your right toe. And it taps in, out, in, step together. So five, six, seven, eight, and one, two, three, four, reach up and push. So you're gonna push your hands to the right but make your hips go to the left. So your hands and your hips are going away from each other. You're going to do the same thing with your left toe. Tap in, out, in. You're gonna finish out. Then flap, step, flap, heel. Because you want your weight to end up on your left foot. So let's try just the toe tappings from the beginning. Five, six, ready, right toe in, out, in, out, and reach, and push. Left toe goes in, 
out, in, out, full lap, step, full lap, heel. Now my right foot is free, so we're going to do the toe tappings again on the right and the left in a row. So we've just gone full lap, heel, then toe, two, three, step, toe, two, three, step, reach up and out and full lap, step, full lap, step. That time it is a step. So from the toe tappings across, we've just gone left, full lap, heel, and toe, two, three, step, and toe, two, three, step, up, and out, and full lap, step, full lap, step. Good, so just little tricks that choreographers do to you. <laughs> when you're doing those full laps to the left, it's full lap, step, full lap, heel, so you want your right foot free again. And after you've tapped your toes again, when you go to the right, it's full lap, step, full lap, step, two full lap steps. And your weight, again, ends up on your left foot. Okay, let's review that much from the beginning. We're gonna start in tapping our left toe. Five, six, ready, and tap, two, three, step, up, and left toe goes in, two, three, and full lap, step, full lap, heel and toe, two, three, step, toe, two, three, step, and up, and out, full lap, step, full lap, step. Okay, let's do it one more time, a little bit faster, and then we'll try it with music. Ready? From the toe tappings. Five, six, seven, tap, a one, two, three, step, reach, and out, and tap, two, three, hold, full lap, step, full lap, heel and toe, two, three, step and toe, two, three, step and reach, out, full lap, step, full lap, step. Good, okay, let's try that with music. We'll hear the bass, it's gonna walk up, start in with the toe tabs. Five, six, Ready, toe taps, and in, two, three, four, up, and out, and a left, two, three, full lap, step, full lap, heel, toe, step, toe, reach, up, out, full lap, step, full lap, step. So now we're going to use that jitterbug step that we learned before, we worked on that before we started, started the choreography. So you've just gone full lap, step, Full lap, step. Then you're gonna go full lap, ball change, full lap, ball change, rock, step, twist, twist, again. Rock, step, twist, twist. So this jitterbug step occurs twice in a row. It will have you starting on your right foot both times. And all I do is the first time I'm doing it, I kind of angle to the stage right and then exact same thing but angle to the stage left. So let's try that again going from the full lap step. So we've reached up and out and full lap, step, full lap, step and triple step, full lap, ball change, ball change, twist, twist, full lap, ball change, full lap, ball change, ball change, twist, twist. I think we're ready to go on because we already learned that before we started the routine. Next, we're going to this truck step twice, full lap, step, full lap, step, then two shuffle ball changes, shuffle, ball change, shuffle, ball change. That we learned at the beginning, which are kind of twisty, ball change, shuffle, ball change. Then you're ready to do one more jitterbug step, full lap, ball change, full lap, ball change, ball, change, twist, twist. So let's go through that whole sequence. So we're gonna jitter bug to the right, to the left, then we're going to truck right twice and shuffle ball change twice to the right, and then one more jitter bug to the right. Let's try it. Five, six, seven, eight, to rip, full step, full lap, ball change, rock, step, twist, and angle left. Triple step, rock, step, truck to the right for two, 
and shuffle ball change for two one more jitterbug rock step twist twist and that takes you to the end of that phrase okay let's review it one more time a little bit faster and then we'll try that with the music from the two jitterbugs right and left five six ready and full up ball change full up ball change rock step twist twist again Rock, step, twist, twist, the lap, step, the lap, step. Shuffle, ball change, and one more. Jitterbug, five, six, seven, eight. We have one more refrain, which will be four counts of eight into the ending. And it's all steps that we know, which I'm just putting them together in different combinations that will be fun with the music. So the last refrain starts out with, we're gonna kind of show off our shuffle ball changes. So as you remember, it's shuffle ball change with a twist. We keep bringing our heels to the center. And we're gonna do eight shuffle ball changes in a row. And as we do them, we're going to rotate to our right, which is clockwise. Eight in a row, five, six, ready, and shuffle ball change. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yay, fun and easy. And then going on from there, you will just do one more shuffle ball change. So technically it's nine in a row. Shuffle, shuffle, ball change, ball lap, ball change. So that changes your weight over. So um, I'm going to think of it as eight shuffle ball changes. And then the next shuffle ball change is going to be one again for me because that's going into a new phrase. But if you want, you can think of it as nine in a row. So coming out of the rotating shovel ball changes, we go shuffle, ball change, ball lap, ball change. Then do it to the left, shuffle, ball change, ball lap, ball change. So that um, gets you alternating from the right back to the left. Let's do that again. Five, six, ready and shuffle ball change ball lap ball change shuffle ball change ball lap ball change for the last eight counts of this refrain we're going to do running full laps which is just alternating full lap two three four so it's a right a left a right a left so just for lapping, brush right, brush left, brush right, brush left, you step on it every time. To make it into running flaps, you just get a little air under. It's like jogging as you lap every time. Okay, so after shuffle, ball change, ball lap, ball change, shuffle, ball change, ball lap, ball change, four full laps, a one, two, three, four, then something fun, a cramp roll. And it's just toe, toe, heel, heel. I have a cramp rolled video. I'll, I'll link it to the video. So I'm gonna kind of rush through this. If you need to brush up on that, check out the other video. Um, for this one, we're gonna add a little brush. Brush, toe, toe, heel, heel, clap. So that phrase of eight counts is four flaps, cramp roll, clap. Goes like this, five, six, seven eight oh one two three four five six seven hold eight okay so out of shuffle ball change for lap ball change into the running flaps and the cramp roll five six seven eight shuffle ball change for lap ball change shuffle ball change for lap ball change and flap two three four cramp roll clap Good, let's try that whole 
refrain, which is four counts of eight, it starts out with the shuffle ball changes going in a circle. So start from shuffle ball change, rotating. Five, six, seven, eight. Shuffle ball change. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Then shuffle ball change, ball lap, ball change to the left, ball change, ball lap, ball change, four full laps. So one, two, three, cramp, roll, clap. My cramp roll was a little messy. That same first, we're going to do it without music, just a little bit faster, because sometimes putting on the music makes our brains go wild. So the eight shuffle ball changes, rotating. Five, six, seven, eight, oh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And shuffle ball change, full lap, ball change. Four full laps. And that's that whole refrain. Let's try that one with music. The blisters are happening. Shuffle ball change. Ready and. so close to the big ending and we just are going to repeat things that we did at the very beginning of our little combination. So we start out with toe tappings on the right and the left. So we tap a one, two, three step, one, two, three step, and then one more round of jitterbug. Ball lap, ball change, ball lap, ball change, ball change, twist, twist. So that there's only two counts of eight in the wrapping up little refrain ending. So that much again on the ending is just the toe taps and one jitterbug. So five, six, ready, and a one, two, three, step, and one, two, jitterbug, step, a one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Then there's a big, the band goes wild on the ending. So you can kind of do whatever you want to do. I fill up the ending by doing a kick and cross my foot over and spin around. I think I do it again. Kick, cross over, spin it around. And then I just swing right, left, and pose. Just keep filling it up until the band gets done. Okay, so let's try, let's see if we can find just the ending of it with the music. Five, six, toe taps. Jitterbug. Kick, turn around, kick, turn around, swing, swing, and yeah, and that's the ending. <laughs> So it's all pretty fun and easy. It's just kind of similar. So it's a matter of remembering what comes next. Let's try it with music. I'm gonna slow down the tempo just a little bit. Five, six, ready, right toe. Tap, one.
very good. It's fun. Let's try it a little faster. Here we go, up to tempo. We can do it. Here we go. Six, ready, and oh. for joining me here today. I hope that you keep tapping, keep jitterbugging. It's great for your mind and your body and your spirit. So keep on tap dancing, keep on kicking. <laughs> That's what we do here at this channel. Uh, if you enjoyed today's lesson, be sure to subscribe and hit the like button. You can also hit the bell if you want to be notified when I put out another tap dancing video. Be sure and leave a comment below. Let me know if there's a step that you'd like to learn or some music that you'd like to dance to. I love hearing from you and I'd like to hear your suggestions. I hope you keep tapping, keep kicking, and I'll see you here next time. Bye-bye. <laughs>